this is just going to be another uh, quick video but uh, as you can see here I have this circuit wired up I have a condenser microphone here it's a component I found in a kit a long time ago and I wanted to make a practical circuit with it and I'm making progress on that so in any case you can see the uh, voice there that is from the amplified uh, part of the circuit I'm going to change the voltage per divisions so that uh, as you can see the uh, voltage per division is smaller so our spikes and stuff are a lot higher our signal I should say is a lot higher so I disconnected that we're just going to look at the microphone uh, part of this so you could see before how when I talked it went way off screen uh, now we just have the uh, microphone there and we have probably about a fifth of the size there so this is probably amplifying what we're getting from the microphone directly about five times so now we're going to take a closer look at the uh, schematic and the circuit there so this is actually a 10 nanofarad pastor I accidentally put uh, 10 microfarad I'll change the uh, diagram before I uh, post it though but uh, any case much smaller value capacitor than that one it just kind of smooths out the voltage when not much is going on for the most part and uh, there's probably smoothing capacitors uh, when it comes to other circuitry so you may not need it but in any case we have the uh, coupling capacitor right here and before we get to that we got the microphone there and these there may not always be a plus symbol there and I don't know what all symbols you might see for a microphone or condenser microphone and uh, so that's kind of the one I like the most but uh, that side has to be the, on the more positive side and uh, where the three lines there come to the body I think is why it's uh, wired like that that has to go to the negative side or ground so we're gonna set that off to the side so that it is a little bit out of the way we have here a coupling capacitor so I'm using 0.47 microfarad because that's the largest value I have in a kit where it's a non-polarized capacitor I don't have a one microfarad but uh, I put a couple in parallel for one microfarad basically and it didn't really seem to make a difference so I'm just using one uh, 0.47 microfarad so that's going up to the uh, 10,000 ohm resistor there and to our uh, capacitor which is actually our uh, output right there so in any case hopefully you can see that we got a little gray jumper coming down uh, underneath the capacitor and make sure we put it the right way so that should be uh, negative where the three lines are and uh, we plug it back in so that's it for the uh, basic uh, microphone part of the circuit so the basic way that this works is that we have to get uh, power to the uh, condenser microphone there through a resistor because it makes kind of like a voltage divider I don't know all the specifics of it but uh, voltage goes up slightly and it goes down slightly as a sound hits the microphone and so when the voltage goes up we have uh, this capacitor here it's a coupling capacitor it's connecting uh, that side of the circuit to uh, input of other uh, circuitry and it takes that rise in voltage and gives a higher uh, voltage out as long as the capacitor doesn't uh, charge up to a steady state uh, but these are very brief uh, voltages so it pushes uh, current that way and uh, raises the voltage a uh, very small amount of current and uh, the less the better then when the voltage drops because remember it's rising and dropping as sound hits it so it's very uh, rapid so it drops that tries to pull current uh, that way and uh, so it pulls that way that gives us a lower voltage you get that uh, quick dip right there and uh, the little uh, stray signals and stuff that are very weak should um, get uh, drowned out by this capacitor it should uh, charge up and discharge to absorb that energy instead of passing it out to the input of something else and uh, so you may need that you may not depends but uh, any case as I said before this is uh, really a new component to me I had it a long time but I didn't really get a working circuit until now and uh, I got a lot more to go but uh, people should find it interesting I think so I figured I'd make videos of uh, my progress so we'll look at more of the circuitry later but uh, there's a lot to this so we're gonna break it up 
and we just have the basic microphone circuit there so hope you enjoyed